coming, big black wheels are humming. People waiting at the station, happy hearts are drumming. Hello, YouTube. Pipe Smoky Cowboy Chris coming at you again. I'm not smoking at the moment, but uh, I just finished a cigar. But I'm going to uh, videotape me checking into the races Aries net. As you can hear, so <clears throat> we'll see how this fares out. And this is my radio. It is a Kenwood uh, dual band TM. Oh, I forget what the model number is. Uh, it's a TM G707. So. Well, I may just do short time, just to, I don't know, it depends, but I kind of want to let you guys know what, what I do with this hobby. I think I'm going to do short time. KA9WLU, no traffic, short time. That's basically about it. So when it And that's it. Um, Calling amateur radio operator, the first letter to the subject, the call sign begins with the letter A3K. Now we'll go back to the, the normal, my normal position here. Um, now, in the event of an of a actual emergency, um, we would uh, get on and uh see what uh uh we need to do uh races means radio amateur emergent uh civil emergency services and then aries is amateur radio emergency services now the races is um under the uh uh, under the emergency management or I think some of it now is called Homeland Security but um, it's um, races you have you have to be um, of course a licensed amateur and I think you have to be at least 18 to join but um, it's under the, the um, basically, it used, um, the old civil defense back in the old, 
um, the old days, and, um, so, um, and then Aries is, um, kind of an offshoot of that, but it's not, uh, regulated, like, uh, so, um, that's on the Racy's repeater. Now, let's say <clears throat> the president declares a, uh, an emergency and, uh, then Racy's would be activated under the president. Uh, so, and then Aries is kind of, Aries does a lot more than, um, Aries is kind of more open. <clears throat> uh, Aries can help out with, um, all sorts of kind of events, like, like, I've, I've done, uh, a, uh, uh, cured, uh, cure de cure, and that, uh, tu, tu, uh, tour de cure, and that was a, uh, bicycle race for diabetes. And, basically, you know, when I saw, uh, you know, the first one, and then, then the last one, uh, so, a report, uh, so, um, so, in an emergency, I can help, and, uh, I love to help, I mean, and anybody, um, can get their ham license. It's a lot easier now than it ever used to be. Used to, you had to have Morse code. Well, now you do not. And, um, <clears throat> And, uh, if that didn't scare you enough, um, when you, uh, back in the day, you, when you had to have Morse code, and then on top of that, you had to go to some place and the FCC would get, would administer the test. Well, that is a thing of the past also. Uh, you have what they call volunteer examiners, which I am one. So, I can, um, and since I've got an extra class license, I can administer all three tests. See, when you, when you get in the entry level, which is called a technician, you can't do anything. <clears throat> but then when you upgrade to general, you can, um, administer the technician test only. But then, um... When you become an extra, you can administer all three. And that kind of sparked why I kind of wanted to get my extra for, uh, for that. But also, you know, um, see, even though you don't get much more bandwidth, but you get a little bit more... Basically, I can talk anywhere in the amateur radio bands that are offered, so I, I can op I could operate anywhere. But now, however, in an emergency, I've heard um, uh, that's a little different, and um, but normally, <clears throat> um, so. And after doing the extra test, that's really when I w really began to spark my interest that, hey, I want to learn how to repair radios. And, you know, that's kind of why I want to open up my own shop. And I know the stuff. It's just I don't know how to troubleshoot. <clears throat> I know all the, com the components and... Uh, what they kind of do, but, but when you get, when you get, but when they're in the, a circuit and all, and, um, uh, that's when I get kind of, like, duh, but, um, 
I do know some, and in in the uh, test equipment, like a an oscilloscope, um, um, another good another uh, good piece of equipment that you would need is uh, a a voltmeter, the multimeters. Um, those help out a lot. Uh, so, and I've been finding out more that a lot of it's voltage related. So if something, you know, doesn't work, check, uh, check voltages. That's, um, kind of what I've been recently learning and, and, uh, so, anyway, I, I just thought I would... Uh, let you uh, bring you along when I checked into the to the net. Um, I I actually kind of started Aries, but uh, I'm not much of a leader, so um, and um, I don't think the EMA the new EMA director wanted me to be a, uh, the Aries emergency coordinator anyway. But that's a different issue and subject but um, other than that you know that's basically what I do and then um, probably in another video I'll uh, get on HF uh, the high frequencies or we call it low band or uh, uh, short wave you know the short wave listeners that's what and so, I highly enjoy it, and, um, my good buddy, One Man Smoke, um, he's got a little HT, and, uh, he, he's trying to get him and his son to, um, get, he's gonna try to get his ham license, so, uh, hopefully he can, you know, and, you know, so, people, you know, I don't trust a cell phone, you know, um, I trust amateur radio before I trust that cell phone, because it can and it will go down like, uh, a bad storm comes through, it'll knock that cell tower out and you could not have signal for a while, amateur radio, it powers out, no big deal. Get battery or get the gen get the generator and boom, you're back up and running and like nothing ever even happened. So it's a good source of emergency communications and I mean I highly recommend it. Um, anybody get their license. I mean you'll end up. Uh, uh, realizing you uh it's a lot it, it it's a lot of fun so with that i'll uh let you go and uh we'll catch you all later so this is pipe smoke cowboy chris stay smoky my friends keep smoking the good stuff and god bless and we'll see you on the next video Loves a coming, big black wheels a humming. People waiting at the station, happy hearts are drumming. 